Hi everybody and welcome back. Um, today's video I'm going to be doing some storage options inside of my uh, micro camper and uh, I'm going to take you along with me on that journey. Um, so let's get right into the video. Okay back in the camper so what the plan is is to take these uh, screw eyes as they're called and I'm going to drill some real small holes in the one by twos um, and then I'm going to place the little eyelets spaced apart every foot and a half or two feet all the way around and the idea being that I could run paracord through there and run it all the way across that's going to give me a place to actually hook stuff to alright so I've got my drill and it's just got a little uh, bit on it to do just the pilot holes. And uh, we'll just zip a couple in there and see how it turns out. Okay, there you have it. I'm sure some of you that are carpenters out there are probably laughing at me. That's fine. Have your laughs. But the idea is here that I'll run the cord through these loop, run through loop, and I'll just run it all along the edge. And I'm going to run some this way across. I think it's going to give me some flexibility as far as what I do for storage, so uh, we'll see. Alright, I've got uh, all the eyelets installed, and I have the 550 paracord ran through, so that's kind of what I've got. I am not a Boy Scout, so I had to look up knots <laughs> best I could anyway. You're probably thinking to yourself, that's real nice, you got a bunch of string ran all through your camper, what are you going to use it for? Well, let me show you. Hat rack. It can also hold keys right by the door, so I don't lose them. My little camera case has a little built-in mini carabiner, so that way I've got a place to put that that's easy to get to as well. My little light here also has a hook on it so I can put it there or if I want to here just kind of put it in where it gives me a lot of places to put it um, it's also a TV mount what I have here is it's a headrest tablet holder let me get to a better spot and I'll show you. So I just have the cord hanging down here. I got two carabiners. And then this mount is a headrest mount for a tablet. So basically these little guys go on the metal bars on a headrest in a car and then you could like w put your tablet so you could watch it in the back seat of a car. Um, but I figured it'd be good for this. It was on Amazon for like 12 bucks. I'll link it below. But that way I can lay down there and my head will go right there and I can watch um, Netflix or whatever I'm watching there. So Rubbermaid makes these um, little pockets. Really thin. They're designed to go between the seat and the center console in your car. So you can put some stuff in there. Um, what I have done is actually I've got a bit of a gap on both sides of the mattress here. So I slid this in here and I'll actually have it further towards the front. 
and that way when I'm done with the tablet for the night I can just slip it in there and I won't roll over and crush it. So just another little idea. Okay, another thing I want to do is run another cord. This is the back side of the trailer. Run one right there and then I will uh, get a little screen and I'll roll up the screen and tie it with velcro straps up here. That way when I want to keep the bugs out but keep the door open roll that down and I'll get magnets because this is all metal all the way through and keep the little critters out while still being able to get a nice ventilation with the windows open and the uh, roof hatch open as well. Anyway that's um, a whole bunch of things that I can do with uh, the new paracord that I have ran through there. Um, I could even do some curtains uh, which I think I'll probably do in lieu of the blinds. Also there's some um, hanging storage that I'm going to try to do but I'll do that in another video. I just kind of wanted to give you a few options here. This could also be done in like a van where you can put the paracord through the uh, grab handles and then run it through the perimeter of the van. So anyway, hope you like the video. Um, comment below if you've got some other ideas that I didn't think of, which you probably do. Uh, give a, me a like and then uh, feel free to subscribe. I'll be doing more of these types of things as I go along and figure out different ways to utilize the space that I have.